I'm Lonnie Webb, and boom, this is On Comics. <laughs> Today we're going to take a look at Carter Mann's Immortal Orphans. It's a series that he's been doing, um, I'm guessing, probably his first comic book series. Uh, I, I don't know how many uh, starts he's had, but we're going to look at one that he's doing. And uh, I think there's a four book set on Amazon, so as a... First time outing, he's doing a pretty good job. Um, and so we have to look at this through the lens of this is a first time outing. Uh, this is not image in the 90s, uh, but you remember the other comics that turned up on the spinner at the same time or shortly after image. There were some, uh, uh, some lower production quality comics. This is in that same vein. So let me uh, let me take a quick swerve off of that. Please, if you do not mind, hit that like button, hit that share button, put this on your Twitter account, subscribe, and oh yes, oh yes, if you are on Rumble, please hit that Rumble button with just a little plus mark. Uh, put that away. As if you didn't already know, I am Lonnie Webb. Yes, I am Lonnie Webb. And I am on comics on YouTube and Rumble and possibly a couple of other places. You can check out what, uh, what I have put out in the world uh, through comic.com. Heck, you can even check out uh, LonnieWeb.com for some uh, some historical grounding. Um, and uh, let me just put that away. We will talk about things that I do on uh, on another video today. We're talking about Carter Man, and um, and he's being bold. He's getting out. On Amazon, he's making a real attempt at it. I'm going to put the link to his comic in the description below. Please go look at it, and um, if nothing else, give give it a view. And uh, I I am encouraging you to uh, uh, to give him some uh, consideration. Now along that line, let's just go ahead. And uh, take a look at you know let's let's start with his description of the comic and uh, and we'll uh, begin with that. Boing. Oh, that was weird. I shifted. All right. So I'm going to have to lean forward. This is small print. Oh, please don't tell any of the young people I did this. Okay. So the Immortal Orphans is a four book series. And um, on this link, he's offering it as a Kindle edition. This is a one-man show. This is Carter. Uh, I don't see anything that indicates he's got a crew working with him. And, uh, and I'm all for it. I, I'm, I've done some one-man show work, and I, I respect that. Immortal Orphans by Carter Mann is an adventure joyride from cover to cover that delivers sci-fi comedy goodness you've been craving. An LGBTQ plus friendly, racially inclusive, and emotionally compelling new saga for the ages. 
okay, I don't know when he wrote this, but uh, the LGBTQUUIOP ABC. Um, shame on the people that make comics that when a, a gay person opens the cover that the, the jaws of the comic actually close on their hands and bite their hands off. That's never happened. CW, Marvel, I mean, Batwoman, Supergirl, Black Lightning, everything. Uh, Marvel, DC, um, Disney, they're force feeding us LGBTQ, whether we want it or not. Um, I don't think there's any media that is not LGBTQ friendly uh, or racially uninclusive. That is, uh, that is virtue signaling to say that in an Amazon uh, description. I'm, I'm not sure that's good marketing. Uh, at this point, because the people who are paying for things aren't being attracted to those quality, to virtue signaling. It's got to be a good story. Now, I'm going to say, I, I just uh, breezed through issue two. Carter is putting together bits of good story. Let's go ahead and keep reading here. Uh, a cosmic portal ties together the destinies of super-powered heroes from throughout time, including Ganyan, a trash man from a hopeless future who's fitted with the latest weapons-grade nanotech against his will and sent back in time to stop a planet-killing event caused by the comic portal. I'm sorry, cosmic portal. Can you imagine somebody opening up a comic book and, and it being a planet ending event? That may be the impetus for a very interesting story. I just throw that out there. Um, he'll bring together a group of quirky misfits from all over the timeline and overcome his own inexperience and person prejudices. Maybe personal. To become the leader he was literally born to be. Uh, might mean figuratively right there the way that uh, that literally works. Just saying. Only one problem. On the other side of the portal exists every earth god ever known to man. And they're not planning to sit this one out. Explore and enjoy the world of immortal orphans today. To start with, in the description, and this is a critique for Carter. If, if you're going to have gods that are not sitting on the sidelines, you got to tell me what the sidelines of what. Uh, is it the planet-killing event? Um, why would the gods be interested? Why would they care? Uh, and if they're going to get involved and stop the planet killing event, why do you need uh, these super powered heroes? And and uh, the the sentence here includes uh, garbage men in the super powered heroes. Uh, the the connective tissue is weak. I'm just adding that in there. Um, or for your future descriptive description. Hey, I'm old. It works. I, I put on glasses to read this. So uh, I beat up on the uh, the marketing description there. That's really not a a big deal. Um, let's go take a peek at the actual comic. I can push the right button. 
There we go. Uh, yeah. So, like I said, this is one man show. This is this is artwork that is by one person, that is produced by one person, um, and you got to give him credit for that. It looks like it was done by a young uh, person in, uh, uh, independent comics who has done this himself. Um, his experience is growing. This is the point where you probably want to get on the Carter Man train. Uh, so the, there's a lot of purple here. It's a Kindle book, so it's not really going to hurt it. Carter, once again, this is just a critique from my own experience. Purple is murder when using printers, especially small batch printing, uh, which most of us have to use since we don't uh, have the money or circulation to go to world press. Um, and there is a lot of, lot of purple. Um, and uh, the... The design is, uh, it, it looks good, it pops. Um, I just don't know about the purple. Uh, and, and the rest, you know, that's your discretion. It's Kindle, it's not going to hurt. All right, let me hop over to this button. Boink. And um, panel by panel, Carter writes a lot of. Um, comedy. I mean, it's, it's, uh, this, this stuff is funny. You can't fault the guy. Uh, lettering's weak. Yeah. He, he's breaking lettering rules, but let's, let's acknowledge that one man show, give him a, give him a pass on the lettering. Um, and, uh, okay. Boob armor. If you're going to do boob armor, it's got to be good to look at. Uh, and uh, and I think by the end of the comic, we have found out that everybody's related somehow. And there's lots of daddy issues being that's going on. And it's discussed right here on this page, I think. Um, let, let's, let's just tell the story. If. You don't read the description. I read the description on, on Amazon later, uh, and, and I enjoyed the read-through because I didn't, I didn't know all this virtue signaling stuff. It was much easier to read without that because that kind of puts a lens in your mind, and you start looking for what sets us apart with those virtue signaling elements. And I can't say that there's a reason to... Uh, to, to bolt that on to what is otherwise a story, uh, easy to follow story. And, uh, and, and I do, just based on the story, I do want to turn the page, which is very, very positive. The perspective gets away from the artist. I think if it's Carter, then for Carter's sake, the perspective you can see in, in panel one, it looks like the 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 page has slipped while you're uh, while you're drawing it, and, and uh, the chin gets bigger than than the rest of the head. But just roll with that, and we will continue on. The uh, I said the the lettering was a little bit of an issue. We acknowledge that. The boob armor's back. And uh, the awkwardly wet man lips are uh, are there. Uh, I'll just leave that there for you. And um, loads loads of purple. The story's still tracking along. I still want to turn the page when I'm reading it. Uh, unusual page layout as as it reads. I guess in in an arc from upper right to the left, 
or from the left to the upper right and then straight down, um, I, I would control that arc a little differently. But um, otherwise, it's, it's uh, keeping you in the story. You still want to turn the page and find out what happens. And the comedy elements continue. Again, the comedy elements, the story writing, is very strong panel by panel, in, inside the panel. Um, and, and I think I have to see all the whole series to be able to uh, uh, speak to the quality of the, uh, the, the whole story. And we have a big event. Some more comedy happens, page by page, more comedy. Here's a, an issue that uh, that keeps coming up there's not a lot of detail so that's that's artistic qualities there are other things happening and and i'm recommending that you give it a look um, it's a notch lower production wise than i want to find from a comic and uh, i'm just going to say uh Carter Man Carter Man uh has done a decent job and uh, I think you should give him a look and I also hope that Carter will take a look at this and take a few elements put a little more detail into the backgrounding and I think you're on your way to having a solid series uh so everybody else thanks for stopping by and I will talk to you when I can. Hey, guess what? We're now on the Twitters. You can look us up at On Comics on the Twitters. If you want to go there and follow us and get whatever great new information is coming along, because there's always something. But lo, you ask, what about the other social medias? Oh, that's heartbreaking. But what I'll do for you is I'm going to send you over to my link tree. And that is L-I-N-K-T-R dot E-E forward slash on comics. Don't worry about the capitalization. You will be taken then to my great page o link. That is everything that is currently going on that involves this, that, or the other thing. You will find some free comics over at the main website. Click on that and you'll have a great old time. And if there's anything else you need, be sure and hit me up through one of those mechanisms. I will talk to you when I can.